The marriage age was 12. When a girl got married, she lost her name and everything she owned, from her combs to her shoes, belonged to her husband. Any money that she brought to the marriage was his. Any children born of that union were also his. So she could leave, she could leave him and run away, but she had no agency, she had no choice. If the 12-year-old, if he decided she didn't need to be educated, that child was not educated because it was he who paid for the education of his children. If she married and went off in a profitable marriage, his wife legally had nothing to say about it. Um, this kind of describes many places in the world right now. Hmm. Um, we have a sex trafficking business that is $90 billion, second only to arms dealing, and it deals mostly in little girls and women. But half of the women in America who are in the, half of the people in law school in America are women, half, more than half in medical school. We're making incursions in business, we're coming up from the bottom, it's just that upper echelon, we haven't broken through. And women's issues are men's problems. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, Sarah, do you want to say something about that?